Hi folks, this is Max from Galaxy S4 Root.com for this week's ROM of the Week for uh, Galaxy S4 AOSP ROM of the Week. Um, check out Carbon ROM, it's on Android 4.3. It is available for AT&T T-Mobile, Sprint, Verizon, US Cellular, and GTI 9505, and also Canadian Galaxy S4s. Uh, let me go ahead and give you a quick look here. Um, Carbon ROM is very similar to AOKP, but they've got slightly different menus um it is actually a lot different uh it, it is similar i'm saying uh, but since there is no aokp um this is one of the better roms that you can install with a lot of the aokp customizations um also slightly different uh feeling as you you will notice here you got the nice kilo kilobytes per second sorry everything's updating suddenly um, which is really nice. You'll know when your phone's updating, uh, maybe there's some stuff going in the background. That zero, uh, zero, zero kilobytes per second will ramp up um, even if there's stuff running in the background. So that is very nice and also when you're downloading stuff, uh, maybe even ROM files, you'll be able to see how fast it is downloading. So I find that very useful and one of the cool features about Carbon ROM. Um, other than that, uh, you will find a 4.3 camera uh, working fine out of the box and this one does not have photosphere but you can go ahead and grab the photosphere APK uh, uninstall the existing gallery and you will be able to easily upgrade uh, with the one that has photosphere and you, you can easily take photos there uh, videos working fine the focal camera is also working um, don't use the pic sphere um, otherwise it works videos and photos work just fine and you can double tap, tap to take a photo um, just don't use the pic sphere it's a little bit buggy just use the photo sphere camera after you install the new APK file um, other than that you get DSP working DSP manager out of the box so you can tweak your sound just like CM 10.2 uh, and also halo floating notifications Let's go actually take a look at carbon fibers. This is where sort of like AOKP ROM control. You can enable the latest halo here. Once you enable it there, you'll be have that button for uh, enabling halo. And it's gonna go through its initial thing. And let me go ahead and show you some of the other stuff. Uh, recent RAM bar, some of the stuff. Um, I do recommend turning this on. And let's do application. Uh, also, you can change the LCD if you want. Um, default is 320. If you'll make a, like a larger resolution, you can put it to like 340 to 360, almost tablet-like, uh, which works really good on the Galaxy S4. And some of the other stuff. This is like very nearly identical. Um, actually, you know what? Not identical, but it takes some of the parts. This is like straight from AOKP. Um, so they take a lot of stuff from AOKP, add their own stuff like the power widgets. Um, this is nice. So you get notification uh, in your notification bar. What happened here? There we go. There we go. So the widget's there. And also uh, ribbons, just like AOKP ROM. And you can kind of swipe left and right to access the menu. Slightly different, uh, which, which is kind of cool. Status bar. Uh, status bar toggles you can change your toggles uh, quick toggles your tiles here and also you can change the vibrator intensity so it does provide a good level of customization and also you got dark carbon um, also it's got performance menu if you do install a overclockable kernel uh, you will you'll be able to overclock using this and you know, and themes other than that, um, you get pretty much everything from like a CM 10.2. Um, also app privacy here, if you wanna control um, some of the stuff that your apps can use, personal information. Other than that, it's a very nice AOSP ROM and working nearly flawless and uh, very nice performance uh, as far as just the whole UI, your browser, um, you know, running apps, you should have no problems with it pretty stable ROM even though these are nightlies uh, I would highly recommend these as a daily driver so definitely check them out uh, if you're looking for a good Android 4.3 custom ROM with a lot of customization 
Um, this is certainly going to give you a ton more customizations over the Google Play Edition ROMs, which I like also, but they're not you know, as customizable, um, so they have their limits. But this one, you can fully customize the way you like it. Um, a, a ton of stuff you can do. And I really love the download speed bar. It always tells you how much uh, internet data you're using you know, at any given point. Um, they should use that on every ROM. Anyway, thanks you guys for watching this video. As always, if you have a Galaxy S4, uh, don't forget to sign up for my email list at galaxyS4root.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, you can get this nice case uh, over at cruiserlight.com. Um, it's there somewhere under Galaxy S4. Very nice case. And I will see you guys soon. Uh, as always, uh, stay high on Android. Yeah.